Welcome my beautiful Aries and hello this is Brenda Tarot and this is your general tarot and oracle card forecast for the week of April the 4th to the 10th 2022. Starting off with your all over energy card and the theme that this could be playing out in the reading is the two of wands and this is movement and choices and you know decisions that have to be made. Um, I do believe that you know with your hard work and great effort and determination you're going to have the ability to juggle all the demands that are in front of you. Whether they concern money, business decisions or other projects it's important to stay flexible and focused but know that you don't have to do this alone. Reach out for the best advice and assistance. In addition, a financial union or partnership may be present uh, to you at the moment too. So I always take this card as, you know, duality. I always take this card as partnership, getting along and probably bringing someone else into the equation, not working all by yourself, taking on the load by yourself because you're working on a goal here. And you may have people there that are advocating, promoting, and defending you. But you're coming into your own and you're taking those steps to improve your career or your business. And you're right on track. So continue going forward and don't be discouraged by any temporary delays. And don't allow anyone to hinder your progress here. Again, I do think you might be, you know, going forward uh, with contracts and business agreements, which could include a partnership or someone here who steps up where you need to sign legal documentation. Now coming in in your first row, Aries, you do have the hangman. Maybe you have to sacrifice something to get something here. You may have to uh, relinquish something in order to uh, have, a, have something come forward. Hanging in limbo, waiting for something to come into play. And you may be thinking, how are you going to deal with this? And often the hangman is associated with giving up something, s sacrificing something to get ahead and to get something at the end of the day that's going to satisfy you and bring you to the situation that you want to be in. I do think that in the process, you're thinking about this. You're working on something. You're planning something. And when you get down, you're going to hit the ground running because this is a temporary pause. But you're not sitting there idle. You're working and thinking about something to go forward. Someone could be stepping forward at this time with the Six of Cups and it could be somebody that you may hear from from your past. They may be coming forward to offer you something in the form of time, effort, support and for others it could even be affection and love. I do think that they come forward for a reason. The universe sets up that alignment for a really good reason. It may come as a surprise for you, but at the last most uh, in, at the last moment, something happens and somebody comes forward. This connection could be good for business. It could be for your personal life. It could be for something, uh, you know, unrelated to that. But definitely, I think you're going to be connecting with someone from a distance or from your past. They're stepping forward. The magician comes forward and says, hey, guess what? You're going to be able to create the magic that you want. And emotionally, you're set now to go forward. I do believe that you're going to get out of this hangman mode. I think that somebody stepping forward here could be helping you with the situation, offering advice or offering their hand and attention uh, and support to get you through something. You could also be connecting with an ex-colleague, an ex, uh, you know, someone you work with, you went to school with, uh, or even someone you had a re an intimate relationship with. For others, I think you're going to be connecting and communicating with your children, whether they're young or they're older. I think it's time now to tap into your own inner child. Be happy again, because I think you're going to have all the resources here to create the magic you want. The universe says you don't have to go any farther here. You've got everything that, at your fingertips to go forward and create the magic that you've always wanted to make. Now, coming in in your center position, I love this, the chariot. You know, getting uh, getting credit for something. What have you done? What have you sacrificed? What have you worked on? All through a period of time here, you're going to see that you're going to get rewards for your hard work and effort, but you're going to also almost like get public recognition. This is an accomplishment, something that was very hard that you had to go in. I mean, the chariot is a champion, but he knows there's risks. He knows there's consequences, but he took the chances anyway with the mindset he wasn't going to give up, roll over, and uh, give in so please don't do that this says you're going to get through this situation no matter how hard it was here and you're in your center position with the with the nine of wands the nine of wands is indicative of don't give up keep going forward uh you know stand your ground stand up for who you are what you want and what you're promoting and defending and uh you know yourself with here uh you know you're going to come out ahead there's going to be a change in energy something swift and precise is going to come in just like that a lot of information a lot of work 
doing up your boot strings and hitting the ground running to go towards your goals and what it is you want. It could be work. Um, you may even be in the process of having to balance your job, balance work and career because you're going to be so busy. Beautiful, beautiful uh, new growth coming into you. This can also be the wands and the arrows of Cupid and love. But I do believe you're going to be seeing a shift of energy. I mean, you know, charging in here towards your goals, not giving up and staying focused is what's going to win the day for sure now three of cups doesn't get much better than that my beautiful aries you're going to have reason to celebrate something and you're going to want to do it with community friends family and those you care about it's going to be absolutely a really really big reason justice comes in maybe you're going to win a court case maybe you're going to you know have the freedom to go and do what you want um you know justice comes in the gavel goes down and it's served in your favor i've always said this with this female with you my beautiful aries when this justice cards come comes up i think there's going to be a female that's going to uh, that's going to save the day. Uh, it could be a female judge, a female lawyer, a female, the crown. Somebody out there in your corner of the ring is there to promote and to defend you. I think you're going to see reason there to celebrate if it's a legal issue. Now you have, an, you have the queen of pentacles giving birth to your dreams. She's, you know, she... She, what she puts her hands to, she turns to gold. She has that ability to, to move forward and she definitely uh, steps up to the plate. And I think you're making plans here. You're going to have to be patient waiting for your harvest to come in. You're working on something. There may still be time here where you're going to feel the, in, in limbo here with, the, with this, um, you know, the hangman uh, in the process of settling something here. I think it's still going to take time before you can go forward towards your goals and celebrate. But celebrate, I do see happening. Absolutely. Beautiful. Wow. Your outcome card. Holy moly. You've got uh, 13 called wisdom. It's time to take out. <clears throat> pardon me. It's time to out. It's time to take time out to relax and rest. Move on. Enjoy exploring wonderful new chapters in your life. Well, I think you're going to be able to do that. Um, <clears throat> you're definitely, you know, something kept you in limbo for a long time, but there's going to be a connection here with somebody that steps in to assist you, to help you create the magic you want. You come out a champion at the end of the day and you get recognized for that and almost public recognition and all because you didn't roll over and give up at the time of struggle. Things are going to speed up. <clears throat> you're going to see that you're going to be very busy planning things that you want to happen. You know, this situation called for something to happen here. And I do believe that the scales of justice came forward and they weighed in your favor here. You're now going to be able to move forward, as I said, with the magician and now with the queen of pentacles. <clears throat> you may be dealing with your children again, because I'm going to step back to children. There could be discussions with your children about where it is you're going and what you're going to be doing with your life or a situation involving them. Because let's face it, families do that. Um, and again, I think you're going to have reason to get together with family and friends and really, really celebrate something. Beautiful, beautiful reading. Um, duality here, partnership, as I said, with, with someone intimate or even in business. So it's time to relax and rest and move on and enjoy the wonderful new chapters coming into you. My beautiful Aries, great positive reading. Well, I wish you a great remainder to today and a beautiful optimistic week here to look forward to. Know that I send you lots and lots of love and many blessings and I'll see you soon.